Welcome to my channel. If you like my videos, then kindly subscribe, like, and watch. Thank you. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Problem 3.8. Uh, this problem is uh, similar to problem 3.7. The statement of problem is that spindle AB is made up of steel with an allowable shearing stress of 12 ksi. So allowable shearing stress in steel is equal to 12 ksi clear and sleeve seed is made up of brass and with an allowable shearing stress of 7 ksi. So allowable shearing stress in brass sleeve is equal to 7 ksi clear so this is the sleeve portion c d determine find first to find clear uh, largest torque t that can be applied at point a so tor largest torque t t largest t t largest at allowable uh, t largest that can be applied A if allowable sharing stress is not exceeded in sleeve CD. Clear? Uh, the, the part B is corresponding value of diameter of spindle AB. So you have to solve this. It's very easy problem. So first we will analyze for the part first that is the largest torque that can be applied in sleeve. Clear? So for sleeve CD. CD. As we know that the largest diameter of sleeve is 3 inch so C2 radius of this will be equal to half of outer diameter which is 3 inch so it will be again 1.5 inch. Also inner radius will be again this is the same so this is the outer radius which is 1.5 so inner radius will be from this to this and this will be this radius minus thickness so which is equal to 1.5 minus thickness which is equal to 0, 1 over 4 which is 0 0.25 and again this is 1.25 inch also polar moment of inertia for this uh, sleeve will be equal to pi by 2 that is equal to c2 4 minus c1 4 which is equal to pi by 2 into C2 is 1.54 minus 1.25 power 4 and this J comes polar moment of inertia comes out to be 4.1172 inch 4. Now you have polar moment of inertia and you can now easily find the torque and you know that this torque is equal to ta into J divided by C. The tie is given as maximum uh, for sleeve or bras that is 7 ksi so 7 into 10 is to power 3 j is 4.1172 divided by c c is the maximum which is c2 that is equal to 1.5 so when you solve it you will get the value of torque that is 19.21 kips so this is the value of torque that can be applied to the sleeve for an allowable sharing stress that is not exceeded in the sleeve. Now for the part B, we have to find diameter of solid spindle. So we will analyze solid spindle AB. Again, let go downward so as we know that shear stress is equal to T into C divided by J and if we write it as J over C if I bring this J over here and T ta is equal so sorry not like this uh, J over here this will be equal to T into C divided by ta and if I bring C over here so I have to divide C on both hand side so it will be J divided by C will be equal to torque divided by shear stress clear also we know that J is equal to pi by 2 into C4 and again this means there will be C that is equal to torque over shear stress 
so this will be equal to pi by 2 c cube we have torque value which is 19.21 into 10 to the power 3 that we have calculated maximum shear uh, torque that can be applied divided by the maximum shear in the solid spindle and maximum shear uh, in the solid spindle is given as 12 ksi clear it is mentioned over here so this is 12 ksi so we will put the value over here that is 12 into 10 is to power 3 so we will have c cube is equal to 2 into 19.21 into 10 is to power 3 divided by pi into 12 into 10 is to power 3 clear if you further solve this so c will be equal to under the root 2 into 19 point 2 into 19 point 2 1 into 10 is to power 3 divided by pi into 12 into 10 is to power 3 so you will get this will be cubic clear so you will get c will be equal to if you calculate it it will be c is equal to 1.006 inch so we have this is the radius of solid shaft since uh, diameter of solid shaft is equal to two times of radius so 2 into 1.006 inch will be equal to 2.0 zero one inch so diameter of solid shaft for the maximum torque and allowable maximum torque of 19.21 into 10 is to power 3 and maximum shearing stress in the steel is 12 ksi comes out to be 2.01 so this diameter comes out to 2.01 each. I hope you have enjoyed the video. If you like my videos, kindly subscribe, like and watch. Thank you.